Do your opinion. Tell every, your audience, does she not look like this lady? Cookie. Cookie. Like Taraji Pen? Yeah. She looks like Cookie. So he's got a picture that's that's uh, going to show that this is part of what's going on. And you showed this picture to Terrence. Absolutely. Okay. Uh, he's handed me the picture. And so they modeled Cookie after the, right the, the lady in your book, which is the... So... Oh! Right. <laughs> wow. Wait, the in the book, the name is Cookie? They yeah. went that bold? Her yes, her name is Cookie in the book. So it's just so many similarities. It it's different books got me. But they got Cookie from Film or Slim. Get back on the mic there. Yeah. Here right here, okay. When I was sitting no, down talking to Terry, you, you yeah. got Cookie from Film or Slim. Slim. Right, okay. okay. Here go Cookie right here. Cookie's in the newspaper right here in San Francisco. Wow, and that's the a name. whole paper. That ain't no news. <laughs> yeah, y'all see come out yesterday. Did y'all not see, everybody see Cookie? Yeah. Y'all take a look. Y'all, everybody want to see Cookie? Yeah, we're yeah. gonna have this. You're gonna be able to go to our, uh, onto our website, speedyandfriend.net, and we're gonna post all this stuff on there. So for those listeners that's in the car going, I can't see shit. This is radio. <laughs> we got it. We, we know it's radio. We going. Yeah, that's up. We gonna put yeah. it together. We gonna put it together. So does you. that not look like? And then okay, look at the storyboard. Yeah, that and, storyboard. And the storyboard is. looks like Empire. Yes. Now okay. let, let me ask Look you. Look at the whole storyboard. Let me ask you this. One. Okay. Okay. Let's say you ask it for how much? A billion dollars. A billion dollars. Okay. Everything go the way you wanted to go. Okay. And they say, okay. Cool. What am I gonna do with the money? Yeah. I'm Let's gonna go. Take there. care of the black ghetto neighborhoods. I'm gonna look out for my black brothers in the neighborhood first. Okay. I'm gonna donate some money, like 50 million, and some of the, you know, hoods mm -hmm. myself. I'm gonna go to their little gym or whatever they got there, sit down and write out checks. Mm. And I put that on God. Oh, that's beautiful. I'm not going to have nobody like Cecil saying, oh, give me the money, I'll pass. No. no. I want to make sure your kid gets something, your kid gets something, so they say, Robin Hood, the new Robin Hood, yes. the hood, <laughs> just gave us money. And we love Ron New. Now, when you wrote this book, in the book, we have it in front of us as well, uh, What what's in the book? You, from the day you started pimping? From or? the day I started, welcome to the pimp game. My mother, I, I, I was a child abuse guy. I had a stepfather uh, who uh, didn't like me. He, uh, he didn't uh, sexually bother me, but he beat me butt naked with extension cards yeah. at a very young age. That's why I was out. Here's another thing. Terrence Howard talks about he was nine years old, right? In my book, I'm nine years old. When I say, I hit the line up. Line up. He's lining up. Huh? And say, he says he killed four drug dealers. I say, and fictitiously, I killed four drug dealers in my book. So let's line it all up. I escaped from drug. Feds bust me at. Uh, as my kids was like at the height of the music game. Yeah. Fans bust him in the last season at his height of his music game. Mm. Yeah. Last episode. Last mm. episode. So let's see what they're going to do when he gets back. Here's what I got to say. If they're breaking my soul, I'm like, I got to do this. I got to do this, y'all. Right, right. If they break him out of prison, his kids, then he really stole my story because my kids and my woman broke me out of prison. Go ahead. Yeah, I, I mean, don't get me wrong. It's lining up. It, it lines up. Uh, and, and your lawyer, he just he ain't gonna take no case. Now what's Brown? He got, no, he got a name. No, so no, yeah. He's just not gonna be like, I'm gonna just do this. Well, so it, that adds a lot to it. But like I said, we have you know you got people that go, well, I know TMZ. Fuck them. Uh, they gonna say what they're gonna say, but. At the end of the day, they're asking like, okay, well, why is this, that, and the other? And you explain mostly all of that away, which is, yeah, why would he come out at the top and say, oh, yeah, I'm going to do this movie. Why not just say, no, I wasn't the original guy to play this part. Somebody else was, and then I got it, which would throw everything. Throw okay, everything. then I want to tell you guys something. See, actually, we got a, it's, it's a guy named Malcolm Spellman who is from Oakland, where I'm from. He was a lawyer, and his daddy was a judge. He... Bought the book down here too, so it was it, it, to me it was like a big conspiracy, because I kept saying there's nothing going on in Hollywood. I kept saying Hollywood is dying, Just TV the is same dying, over and, over and, and, and I used to tell Doobie, I said Doobie, if they ever get my story, it's gonna be crazy. He said, well, I knew go crazy that woke up crazy, and I said Doobie, if they ever get my story, it's gonna be crazy. So he, Doobie, called me one day and said, Ron. I don't think you're crazy no more. I said, what you mean? He said, I, 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 think, that, I think you got something. I said, dude, because I take his opinion real deeply because yeah, that's my best friend. And he said, because you used to tell me, take your crazy ass home. Go on back to San Francisco with your crazy ass. Go on home and come back to see me in two weeks. And at this time, he said, oh, 
Oh, we finna jet set now. Now let's, say, okay, now let's say someone's listening and they're like, yeah, whatever. What's the one thing you can say to somebody that's not in this room, uh-huh. that's listening, driving in their truck, listening at their job, that would make them go, you may have a point, that you haven't told us. Give us something, another point of, of, of uh, reference about your life. I had a woman, one woman did, uh, got uh, 15 years of my cookie deal. She got 17, my girl got 15. That's, 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 uh, I mean, the meeting alone is just a, what takes the cake, is the meeting, here goes my stairs.